Well, good evening, everybody. Some nice, clear conditions out there here across the basin. Really not seeing too much in the way of cloud cover overhead in West, or rather in the basin currently, but off in the distance, you may notice a couple of clouds out there, depending on which way you're looking, and you may even see a couple of flashes of lightning, too, because there are a few thunderstorms still nearby. It's just they're not overhead here in Odessa Midland. Again, we've got our little planet friend showing up here right almost in the center of the frame, so eh, partly clear clear skies. Again, depending on which way you're looking. Thanks to our Sky Tracker Network. Really good look outside, but switching over to our satellite and radar, we can take a look at a lot of rain actually in the southern half almost of the United States. Uh, what's left of Hurricane Nicholas is still kind of hanging around the coast along Louisiana and Mississippi, bringing a lot of rainfall to those southeastern states even still. But here in West Texas, no need to be jealous. We are picking up a little bit of rain here in West Texas. Now, most of that is in the northern Northern Trans-Pecos and through some of the higher elevations. Caught a lot of rain earlier in the day along the Marfa Plateau, but now we're just left with a pretty light rain amounts right now. Just some light showers currently working down to the south and east. Still a few lightning strikes on there, so technically that is thunderstorm activity, but really it's not going to intensify as we continue through the evening hours. Thankfully, no hail to be speaking of currently. None of that right around Alpine or Marathon like we were looking at earlier in the afternoon. We also see a couple of thunderstorms moving towards Pecos, moving through Pecos and tracking off to the east. That is also dissipating. So because we've seen a lot of rain for a long period of time, could be looking at a chance for some flooding. So be careful driving around for the rest of this evening. Make sure to use a lot of caution, especially if you encounter flooded over roadways. Go slowly or even better, turn around, don't drown. Now, as we get to tomorrow, we've got another small, small chance here in Odessa Midland to see some more thunderstorms developing in the afternoon for well, the late afternoon and early evening hours. High temperatures are going to be picking up near 100 degrees for tomorrow here in Odessa Midland. So make sure to drink a lot of water. Stay safe with that sunshine. Be careful because again, we do have a chance for even more rain. Now, any rain that we've got out there right now, that's going to be moving out here in the next couple of hours at the most. I expect by about midnight, most of that rain will have died down entirely, leaving us with some clear conditions to wake up to. But as we head to the afternoon, look, here we go again. Another round of thunderstorms first sprouting up south of I-10. Then as we head to the evening hours, right around sunset, looks like the basin likely to pick up a couple of thunderstorms too. Now, this model is placing those storms directly over Odessa and Midland, but it doesn't really look like there's much in the way of a setup for these storms, so I maintain only a 20% chance to see some rainfall tomorrow afternoon. Thankfully, severe weather effects are going to be low, low chances for any hail to develop or any kind of strong winds or anything like that, but it is going to be hot, and with that rain, could cool things down pretty quickly right around sunset. Saturday would cool down to 95 for our highs there, but it's not until Tuesday that we see our next cold front. Carson, i got to say, I am really looking forward to this front. It's also coming with a chance of rain, but really more so, it's going to make things feel like fall. All right, yeah, I was going to say, you know, we're in September. It's really felt like summer still, so this will be a nice change of pace. Indeed, I can't wait. All right, thanks, Jace. Thanks.